What's good? This is Chris Knowles here sharing my photos from Fortress Fest 2019 held at the Will Rogers Coliseum. It was an amazing time, so I wanted to share some photos with you. Uh, so I have 10 photos and I have one more as a bonus. So hold tight as I just dialogue through these photos. Uh, let me dive into it though. First photo is just a, right in the middle of Fortress Fest. So you have two stages. Uh, one behind me, uh, several feet, and then one to in front of me to my left, several feet in front of me. So um, you have two stages going back and forth. So 30 seconds, 30 minutes on one stage, a artist is performing, and then you go back for another 30 minutes to a second artist. It's a lot of fun. So this first photo is in between both. So you have the balloons that were created by Jay Wilkinson and this did an amazing job. Um, quick <laughs> little thing about it. So they only survived the first day um, because at night during Saturday, it just rained, wiped them out. But hey, if you weren't there the first day, then you missed out on an amazing exhibit. Um, anyhow, so let me go kind of work my way down in the photo. So of course, it's uh, like 12 p.m., 1 p.m. in this photo. So the sun's really high in the sky. Everybody's sweating, trying to get into the shade. So you have the people here in the middle, um, this basically silhouette of folks, and then you have on the bottom where the darker parts of the photo are. Uh, I just really like this. Uh, it's very appealing to me. I like to take black and white. So when I walked on this scene, going to stage two, I was like, I got to take this shot. Um, moving to uh, picture two. So we have Cardiac the Ghost. This is my first time seeing this gentleman perform and also hearing his music. Um, as you see, he just has a distinct style. You have, <clears throat> excuse me, you have um, his belt there. Um, what it reminded me of is actually my mother in a sense because she was very stylish. Always had a, just cool belts, uh, jewelry. She loved turquoise as well. Anyhow, this belt, she I remember seeing her wear this type of belt uh, when I was growing up. She always had wore skirts and things of that sort. Anyhow, so that's one reason I took this shot. Also, Cardiac the Ghost is a pretty cool kind of stage presence in the sense of just his stance in this in, in this one. As you see, he's standing on the he's standing on the uh, speakers. Sorry, it took me a while. <laughs> he's standing on the speakers, and you can tell I'm at a concert because you have a photographer to his left and to our right as we look at the photo, and to the bottom left of the photo, you see someone in the photo pit. I was not in the photo pit for this shot, but I made it a point to get to the front of the crowd, take some shots for myself, um, and just do my thing, really. <clears throat> Next photo, Cardiac at the Ghost again. You see his DJ in the back. Um, you see two are left in the photo. You see his stance. Uh, I thought that was really neat because he's sitting on the speaker. I'm in front of him, of course. We have, this is a colored photo as you see in the next several photos really all of them other than this one are going to be black and white but you have the belt again you have his socks which are blue um moving to the right of the photo you have the artist pass which is purple so it's pretty cool purple and blue action there kind of bouncing back and forth for myself personally you have his kicks there running rocking some nikes and you also have the fishnets on his right hand where his microphone is. Then you can kind of analyze his tattoos as well. Moving to the next photo, Cardiac the, Cardiac the Ghost again. Just a happy, man, just happy feeling. Um, this should make you smile when you see this photo. No doubt about it. Again, he's just kind of like a victory pose. You see his tattoos and see the belt. Just as his whole expression just, just makes me happy in this photo. He was the first act on Saturday, so everybody's having a blast. Happy that Fortress Fest is here again. 2020 is going to be even better. Go ahead and get your tickets now if you can. I waited too long <laughs> and grabbed them later. Could have saved some money, so it's a little tip for you. Next photo, I have a gentleman here that I met through my friend. Him, uh, the gentleman in the photo, him and his girlfriend were there. This gentleman's from Colorado, and... They flew out to see Fortress Fest, which is pretty amazing. And one thing, my, one of my favorite things about Fortress Fest is it is local here in Fort Worth, Texas. And being a Fort Worth native, you know, I've traveled other 
cities and states to see whomever you know wherever and you know you got to pay for stay you got to pay for the flight and all that stuff but really, one thing i really like about fortress fest is that it's local all i have to do is buy the ticket i can actually walk there if i want it i can just uber like saving so much money so why not have a blast while i'm there anyhow so this gentleman in the photo what i like about it is it's the glasses and i've seen these glasses before it's on social media whatever it may be um the grand internet um, but what I liked about it is how the sun was to his right in this photo and it's just kind of gleaming down, kind of going past his face, kind of brazing his, his cheek. And then also you have him rocking his Fuji, you can tell by the strap and also his shirt was pretty cool. I'm sure if I, you know, translate this into black, I'm sorry, to color, then you'll see pretty cool, like reds, greens, yellows in his shirt from the parrots that he has on his shirt. Um, so I do appreciate this man for standing still for a couple of seconds and let me take photos. Next shot. So we have Sway Lee from Ray Shermer and amazing energy. So second time seeing him. The first time I saw him was at Complex Con uh, last year, 2018. Um, so this year I have to go see him at Fortress Fest. So you can, see, tell, of course, tell we're at the concert. That's what Fortress Fest is about. A lot of acts, a lot of fun and a lot of just music. Um, a lot of food as well. Um, so you see I'm in the crowd. Um, I have Sway Lee right in the middle of the shot. And one thing, I, I was using a uh, SX740 Canon. Um, just bought it, um, the silver version. It's a lot of fun. Um, not the best in low light, in my opinion. But hey, I'm using the lights to my advantage. You see behind Ray Sherman on the top portion of the photo, you see the lights coming down. And so I use my flash to fill in with an additional light for the front. Well, otherwise, it would be a silhouette. And you'll see some silhouettes later on in this, in this slideshow. Next photo. So we have his brother here, um, I believe. I could be wrong, but this is another gentleman in Ray Shermer. I don't know too much about him, like I said, it's the second time seeing them. Anyhow, you have the light fixtures on the top, just cool light show as well. Um, also, this is a silhouette of this gentleman. Um, he brings a lot of energy to the performance. This is, again, this is my second time seeing them. And let's go ahead and go to the next photo. This photo here is one of my favorites from this series. Um, so, of course, you have Sway Lee in the middle. You have phones up in the air. It's what they do at concerts. They're always recording the whole show. Um, sometimes I wonder, like, are you enjoying the show or are you just recording it all? But that's my just my thought on it. Um, you could say, why are you taking photos the whole time, Chris? Are you enjoying it? But anyhow, I'm having a blast. I'm sure they're having a blast. Uh, as you notice to the bottom right of the photo, you have a gentleman just basically facing um, Sway Lee and just trying to grab a shot or a video as well. Um, just really liked his hat in this photo too. Uh, and just see the light on his face. And then also, if you look at the top left portion of the photo, you have the light directing your eyes towards Sway Lee. Some of my favorite things. Um, I could not plan this shot, but I have to be able to take the shot. That makes sense. Next shot. So I have a young lady here from Churches. They were the headliner of Saturday. Um, it's nighttime. Um, and then also I'm using the lights to my advantage. I didn't use a flash here. So, you know, I say I got lucky if you like. Or maybe I'm just patient. I'm just waiting for the lights to just flicker. And you just, I'm just kind of analyzing the show as I go. Um, of course, the band is, was amazing. I have the drummer back there. You have the keyist there, there uh, pianist, whatever the technical name is for it. You have the silhouette of this gentleman in front of me. Um, you have the silhouette of this Yale lady to his right. Um, just have, you know, things going on here. Um, if I want to change something on this photo, I probably would have just kind of rotated the camera. Uh, downwards and kind of fill the frame a little bit more with this gentleman to the right. You see his ear here right by the lights and then I was kind of framed him higher in the photo along with the young lady on the stage. Next photo here, same band, Churches, Amazing Light Show, decide to do a silhouette on this one. As you see again to the left of the photo you have the gentleman or lady holding a phone up in the air recording it so you kind of get the, it's the same shot in two different places which is pretty cool. Um, we had the lights in the back again again did a silhouette. 
um, had a lot of fun. Um, so that is the 10 photos that I collected um, on day one. Of course, there's more um, good ones, bad ones, ugly ones, fantastic ones, whatever it may be. Uh, but I want to keep this video very short. Um, anyhow, there's one more photo. It's a bonus photo. And so this one here is... Man, I don't know. I just like the photo. You have somebody lighting up a cigarette and you have them sharing a moment, basically. So I'm just capturing that moment. So you can, you can title this one if you want it. Do you have a lighter? You know, do you have a light? Do you have a cig? Whatever it may be. Um, but I just like this photo and want to share it with you guys. I do thank you for swinging by, clicking on the link and everything. Um, share this if you like. It will be very appreciated. And anyhow, I'll be doing this more often because I just enjoy just talking through these things and sharing sharing you uh, the sharing with you the moments as well. Um, take it easy.